What's up guys? Today we're going to be applying some new thermal paste to the CPU on the HP Pavilion Gaming Desktop model number TG01-0023W. It has the 400 watt power supply, 8 gigs of DDR4 RAM, the 256 gigabyte SSD NVMe, and the Ryzen 5 3500. Before I start the video, I would just like to take a second and say, if you guys want me to make any other kinds of videos, just let me know. Um, I'm thinking about continuing this series with this, but I also have a bunch of other computers that I can build and make some budget builds and stuff like that. But let's begin. You're going to need some new thermal paste, a tool to get off the CPU cooler and then to get off the side panel, and optional dish to put all your screws in. Let's begin. Are right, you going to take this screw out first. And then you can slide the panel that way. Next thing you're going to do is you could remove this and this, but you don't have to, so I'm not going to. You're going to take out this screw, this screw, screw right there, and then the other one right there. All right, once you do that, you pull this up. The CPU fan for the CPU heatsink will be plugged in up there. Undo that, and you can see where it goes because it says CPU fan. Now, you're gonna wanna clean this. You can use some isopropyl alcohol, a lint-free rag, so you don't get any of the fuzzies all in there. And uh, I'll get back to you guys once I clean it. So just like that. Once your CPU is all clean and your heat sinks all clean too, take your thermal paste and you want to put about the size of a pea right there in the center. And that's good. Now take your CPU fan and plug it back in right there. Now whenever you're tying up these four little screws, you're going to want to do it in increments. So do this one a little bit, then do that one, then do this one, and then do that one a little bit. And keep doing it equally until it's all the way tight. Once you got all those tight and you know you can give it a good little wiggle, it's on there tight. Take your side panel. Then reapply the screw. Then you're all done. Thanks for watching guys and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I also wanted to give a quick shout out to everyone who subscribed and continues to support my channel. It means a lot to me. Um, just let me know, like I said earlier in the video, with what content you guys want to see. I can continue doing this, or I can, you know, spice it up and do some other things.